Okay, so surprise, got one more thing I wanted to show you guys with the plasma cutter today. So we did all of our cuts originally by hand. I showed you where I was going too slow, where I was going too fast. We talked about holding the torch too high and all that. Lastly, I just wanted to show you guys an absolutely flawless plasma cut. So we broke out our automatic welding carriage here. You can put a plasma cutter in it. You can put a MIG torch in it if you wanted to. We got it all set up perfect. We're gonna cut some of this plate. We've already done a few sample pieces. We're gonna come in a lot closer so you can take a look at the striations in this and you can actually see exactly what I was talking about and how perfect this cuts. So this is gonna be the end of the video when we're done this, but I wanted to show you guys kind of the perfection of what this plasma cutter can do if you take my shaky human hand out of the equation. So stick around, this is actually pretty cool. All right, well that was pretty cool. So we brought this thing out and we used the chart directly from the plasma cutter owner's manual that gave you sort of uh, the speed versus the heat that you need to achieve a perfect cut. That's what we punched into our fancy little machine here. I know those numbers check out because we got a beautiful cut. I don't think you guys can see these striations because I'm blocking the light, but we're gonna move the camera. We're gonna come in really close so you can see exactly what I was talking about with those cutting lines, right? So let's go ahead, we're gonna, oh, Safety first, get my cutting glasses on. We're gonna pop that off. Now we let this cool down a little bit so this slag's gonna be a little harder to remove. Oh, not that hard though. Oh, look at that, <laughs> beautiful. It does not get much better than that. It looks like we just pulled it out of the shear. I mean, that's unbelievable. What a gorgeous cut. Okay, I'm gonna get the cameraman to come on in. We're gonna light this up for you guys so you can see this here. And this is the example of what this plasma cutter can do if it's set and balanced perfectly. And uh, yeah, just an absolutely fabulous cut. I'm excited to show you guys. Okay, so we've brought the camera in and we've adjusted the lights. And look, if you follow along here, these marks here are from my chipping hammer. There's another one there where I put a little dent in it. But otherwise, look at the face of this absolutely flawless but if you look along the dark edge it's a little easier for your eye to catch you can see those perfectly bent striations like we were talking about when you get an absolutely flawless cut you run along the top edge no dross very small amount that came off evenly across the bottom just a whack or two we were done and then if i look at this from the side we have no bevel one way or the other because we use this incredible machine to assist in staying steady all in all one of the nicer plasma cuts uh, I think I've ever seen. Really cool stuff.